Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So I am so, 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 so excited for this video. But first I should probably say sorry. It has been so long since I have uploaded. Um, I just have, honestly, I just have not had time. Um, but yeah, so it's been really, really crazy and it's been very hard to upload. Um, I did film and edit a few videos and I just, they were not how I wanted them to be, so I just decided not to upload them. But yeah, so I'm back today and I'm really excited to show you guys a new product that just came out from Sephora. It is limited edition, so I don't know how much longer they'll be available. If you guys like the product after you see this, then you should definitely go snag it really quickly before they all go. Um, and it's a brush set. So Sephora has many, many, many different brushes. If you go to the store, there's an overwhelming selection of brushes. But every so often they come out with a specialty set. I have the original set, which is the acrylic the clear, the clear, bleh, the clear acrylic stand with the five brushes that stick out. That one I love. It has the chrome ferrules. You guys have seen me use it in almost every single one of my videos. I love, love, love those brushes. So when I saw that this was coming out, I had to get it. It is a gold version. So this is one of their. This is their 24 karat gold mine brush set. The brushes are, the bristles are infused with 24 karat gold. I don't know how that's gonna help your makeup in any way, I don't know. I know that gold does help with acne. There's a lot of soaps that have gold in it, but for the purpose of your makeup, I, I don't know what difference it makes. The set is $85, excuse the nail polish. The set is $85, it's a $225 value. Yeah, it's an amazing set. It comes in this beautiful, beautiful packaging. I'm in love with it. Um, I'm gonna use this box as a just a display thing for who knows what. It's so beautiful. I'll open it up for you. It has the plastic sleeve covering. And then inside are the brushes with the gold stand with the same texturized um, gold pattern as on the box. But the box is a fabric feel and the um, the stand is a, it's kind of a metalized wood finish. Let me take it out for you. The, ah! Okay, <laughs> so we're just gonna drop all of them. So this is what they look like. Are these not so beautiful? I mean guys, these brushes are just phenomenal. I did use them, I tried them a little bit. Um, but they're they're so beautiful. This stand is gorgeous. It has a velvet um, finished bottom so it doesn't slide. It's, it's hollow. It's carved wood, so it's really cool. It's, it, the set is beautiful. Each of the brushes have this mattified rubber texture bottom, which is black, which goes great with the gold ferrule. This is a he they're huge too, some of these brushes. And this set is just, oh, it's so beautiful, so luxurious. They're such high quality. Um, the ferrules are very sturdy. The edges are not sharp, so they don't, they're, ugh. And look at that. Look at that line on that dome. It's, they're so finely cut and just beautifully packed, and they're very soft. I mean, they, they're so, so, so soft. And look how big they are. That's so nice. You get, the handles are just so nice to hold. You just feel like, I don't know. I feel like this is how, Charlotte Tilbury and Coco Chanel do their makeup every day with just beautiful high-end brushes. You know, it makes you feel like a prince or a princess. And I am in love with this set. It comes with a foundation brush, which is a round top kabuki, very densely packed. Um, this is great for stippling in cream product or whatever you want. I mean, these brushes are so versatile. I love them. The next brush is this very fluffy powder brush, which I am, look how it moves, I mean, it's so soft, you could highlight with it, you could contour, you do your blush, whatever, apply loose powder under the eyes. This brush is just great for whatever you want and it is, like all of them, so, so, so soft. Sephora did a phenomenal job and again, look at these ferrules. Ugh, to die for, they're so, so, so pretty. Oh, okay. Moving on, the next is their Precision Corrector Brush. So this is a concealer brush for blending out under eye concealer or doing spot concealing. I don't ever wear concealer for like blemishes, I'll just do my under eye. But even that I don't use a brush for, so I mainly will probably use this for buffing out the crease. This next one is kind of a weird brush. I don't really, I tried using it for what it's intended purposes and I don't, I'm not too sure about it. It says all over shadow brush. 
it has this really wispy, like domed finish to it. It's very similar to the Wayne Goss, I think the number one brush, the foundation brush. And I don't really know how that would work for eyeshadow. I don't know if my particular brush was not milled right. It looks like maybe these were supposed to be in like an even line, but I don't know. So I think this would actually be really good for stippling on cream highlighter or blending out things like that. But I will definitely find a use for it. It's just such a beautiful, beautiful brush. Moving on, I love when we get to the thin ones because they're just, they're so beautiful. I love the eye brushes. This is a domed crease brush. I've used it a little bit and I must say it performs beautifully. It's very tightly packed, um, again with the mat mattified finish. And I love the eye brushes because once you get to those, the black part gets longer so it looks more like a I don't know, like an artist paintbrush or a stiletto, and then you have the fat chubby one. Like they're, it's so cool. I love these, and I guess they're actually around the same exact length. It just looks different. Hmm, that's interesting. So the final brush is the Soft Focus Liner brush. It's just a flat definer brush. Um, I did use this for what it says for soft lining under the eye and blending out shadow and oh my gosh it is a dream to work with it is so soft so so luxurious and I can just tell that they spend so much time with the formulation of these bristles because they're clearly synthetic um, and I don't I wouldn't I wouldn't doubt it if there's actually gold in these even if it's just trace amounts they're they're so beautifully formulated. And yeah, so guys, this is the new gold 24 karat gold mine brush set from Sephora. The brushes are amazing. They're such high quality. They are beautiful. They're so soft. And who doesn't want this sitting on your vanity? I mean, come on. They're fanned out this way. They're, uh, they're so beautiful. And they really are just a dream to work with. I'll do a full demo with them, but just having these big handle is so nice on this foundation brush, the softness of this one. I mean, I there's not a negative thing I have to say about any of these brushes except for the all over shadow brush, just because it's a weird shape. Um, and I don't, I've, and that's fine. I've just never encountered a brush like this, so I'm not sure how to use it, but I'll figure something out. Um, so then no, I don't have anything negative to say about this brush set. It is beautiful, it is affordable, $85 for this, when most of these brushes at Sephora would normally be between, I don't know, $20 to $30 is amazing. So I'm in love with this set. You guys should definitely go onto Sephora's website right now to check it out. I don't know how long this is gonna last. I, I just randomly saw it when I was browsing. I wasn't given any information about this set, so I don't know. I would definitely just go grab them before they're gone. And yeah, I hope some of you guys decide to try these out because I am so happy I did. I think it's going to be a wonderful, wonderful addition to my brush collection. And that's it. Thank you so much for watching. I'll catch you guys next time. And before I go, look at how big they are today. Like, are you kidding? My lashes have never been this long. I'm so happy. And until next time, bye ya. Oh, it's a new day, it's a new life for me, and I'm feeling.